What is going on, guys? It's your boy MGH, so I came Miles Marcus. Here today, we're back with another video. I still don't know what's going on with my face cam. Uh, boy, I got a cut and all that good stuff, so. Excuse me. Whew. We are in here right now. We got so Ghost of Tsushima. State of play, bruh. PS4, you already know how we rocking, man. Uh, I'm so happy we finally got some gameplay for Ghost of Tsushima, bruh. It's like a, it's, and it's a good lengthy one, too, so we're definitely gonna be breaking it down, all that good stuff. Um, you know, talking about it and all that crazy stuff, bruh. I can't wait to see, like, what kind of gameplay, what, you know, what the mechanics are gonna be looking like. I already know the graphics are gonna be really great and all that good stuff. Um, no, I expect not, I expect great things from this gameplay trailer, man. And uh, hopefully it comes out, you know, pretty good. And I can't wait for, wait for the game to come out. So, well, without further ado, let's get on with the video, shall we? You are 30, no. Let's go. Did my PlayStation cut off? Okay. Suck your pants. Hello, everyone. I'm Jason Connell from Sucker What's up, Punch bro? Productions. We have a lot to show you today about Ghost of Tsushima. Okay. Combat, customization, special modes. But first... Let's take the customization, I just can't wait for. I can't wait for the uh, play show customization. Exploring Tsushima. Uh oh. Exploration has been at the heart of our open world design since the very beginning. Dang, look how beautiful you the game have looks, man. If you don't have it's great. So we Bro, imagine this came out on ourselves. Uh, imagine this comes out on the PS5, man. Guide you I think it in the most look. thematic and immersive ways possible. Bro, I love the soundtrack that Japan, that, uh, that's a Japan, that samurai type soundtrack music, bro. Love it. Got the sound effects and everything too, like the, the like you guys know, like the. Right, I'm, stop. I'm just gonna stop, bro. I like the, the, everything that sounds good. Man. Yeah, details great, man. Everything uh, you gotta appreciate the small things too, man. Games, bro. Games like this, you just like, you gotta appreciate the detail. Okay, okay, we got a Lucy. We got a Lucy. Bro, look at bro, look at the detail, bro. Oh, this game is looking good. I know I'm spazzing out right now, but bro, it looks great, man. You gotta appreciate these things, man. Uh oh. What's that? Kiggle crazy, buddy. Also take you to your next big story moment or even help you find rare collectibles but what about the things that you don't know about that you haven't seen yet that you don't know exist 
Keep your eyes peeled for other visual cues. Smoke stacks on the horizons, interesting and odd shaped trees, or maybe even animals trying to get your attention. Quickly, no move. Uh. He's not gonna talk to him. He's just not gonna talk to him. Okay. Let's go, Nubu. Right, is, is his name Boo Boo? Let's go, Boo Boo. <laughs> Wait, how come he's not talking to him now? There's an actual fox, too. My question is, can you hunt? Like, can you hunt in this game? And, like, well, how big is the world going to be? Like, how far can you actually explore, in, like, in this game? How big is the open world going to actually be? Are you, like, limited? Oh, that was cool. I like that. That was pretty cool. Hmm. Like how big is the world going to be? Can you actually explore? Cause you know how like you know in open world games stuff like that. You know, like it's not you can explore, but you can't really explore. Sishima is the rich with world. exploration and discovery. Looks at me, it looks like it's going Whether to be you're just cool. following a string of Tory gates that'll lead you to a high mountain shrine, or maybe it's just a fox trying to show you something hidden in the woods. Either way, bring your sense of adventure and let the wind guide you. That looks, that looks nice. That looks really nice, man. Bro, this game looks beautiful, bro. I know I, I know I keep saying I saw the record, bro, but dude, look at this. I expect big things, but the world looks big. Bro. I expect big things from this game, bro. Gosh, look at this. It's like it's running on a PC, my boys. Jin the Samurai. Hi, this is Nate Fox oh, from Sucker Punch. Grass. Now, we just showed you some exploration, but let's switch gears and check out some combat. Oh, finally, some combat up in here. Okay, I'm down with that. Big bets, big bets, big bets. Yeah, you know. Let's see, man. If you've ever seen Let's a samurai see movie, you know what to expect. Excuse me, bruh. Two warriors sizing each other up, waiting for the other to make the first move. Fight me! He's in there fighting! Oh, so he's like, hey, but we do it, do it. We do it, do it. Come on, man. Oh, shoot, that slow motion was crazy. Yo! That slow motion was crazy, huh? Okay. Boy, that slow motion was crazy. As you can see, the Mongols are everywhere on this island. Oh, come on. For Jin to succeed, he has to use real skillful precision in fighting them. No wasted energy. Every strike must Oh, is that... Ew. That dip game. This dip game too crazy. 
Oh, bro. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Chill, bro. Chill, bro. Chill, bro. Bro, that was crazy. He even bowed down. You can even bow down after that, too. He even showed respects. He even showed his respect. That's a true samurai right there, bro. Jin the ghost. Listen. Okay, so that was Jin fighting as a samurai. Right. But now let's see him take on the same group of Mongols as the dishonorable ghost. Uh oh. As the ghost, he'll use every dirty trick he can think up to even the odds. Oh, so it's like a, even it's like a, sorry, so like when the nighttime comes around, he's like a whole different type of fighter. So this is like a, so this is like a Assassin's Creed type beat. Okay. All right, this is definitely like some Assassin's Creed right here, bro. The whole stealth. That's an Assassin's Creed move. That's my, as Flight would say, that's my type of move. So. That's that's uh Ezio's type of move. That's quite what's uh if he was speaking Assassin's Creed terms. Hey, I gotta watch that show and see. Nah, chill. Bro, I love that transition though. I love how he like moves on with the group. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. I'm in love, bro. I'm in love, bro. All right, all right, all right, all right. This is all cool and all. But this better not be like some infamous Second Son uh, length game, bro. I'm talking, I want like 75 hours out this game, bro. I want, bro, they disappointed with the infamous time, bro. I want like... I'm talking like uh, maybe like 70 hours out this game, bro. I want 75 hours out this game. I'll put listen. I'll put the time in, bro. If it's a game I'm really like caring about, bro, I'll put the time in. I at least give me like 50, 60 hours out this game, please, please. I'm not. I don't want no 25 hours, 35 hours, bro. I want the big numbers. Cause like, bro, I feel like you make a game, bro. You make something like this, man. You have to, you have, the game has to be long. I'm sorry. Open world games have to be long. I'm sorry. They have to be like 70-something hours, man. You know? I want this to at least be like Red Dead type length. Not no infamous second sign length. I want some, like, some actual length of this game. Man. I, 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 this world is too big not to have, like, a lot of hours. Man. Dang, look at that impact, bro. We on a ship ship. We on a ship ship? Oh man, I love the parkour. The parkour in this game is really good too. So far this game is perfect perfect. I think this game is a 10 out of 10 so far. I'm loving everything about this game. This game is looking freaking outstanding. It's beautiful. Oh god. Oh gosh. That, this is just so beautifully well done. Sucker Press, like I said, Sucker Press is one of the best in the game, don't get me wrong, but after this point, the Infinite Second Son, in terms of length, bro, I just need this game to be like, maybe, I don't know. I just want this game to be long. I want this game to be great, man. Like, listen, Last of Us 2 is already getting catching a lot of, uh, like, you know what I mean? Ghost of Machine, they might mess around and get game of the year. Everybody was talking about Last of Us 2 might get game of the year. I don't you know. Might have noticed you might, that while fighting as the year, samurai Ghost or better being or sneaking around three. as the ghost, Jin and don't get me wrong, we still got Cyberpunk coming out. Armor. Don't get me wrong. That's going to be That's the top three games the this year. Armor in this regardless game actually gives you different it. mechanical advantages. Regardless how we all feel about Last of Us 2, it's still going to be in the conversation for Game of the Year. I don't care what nobody says. Regardless how anybody feels about Last of Us 2, 
it's going to be the game of your conversation. Still, I don't care. Last of Us 2, I don't, even if the game is bad, even if the game is bad and people, you know, wind up to make it be, it's still going to be a game of your conversation because of the gameplay alone. And that's a fact. Last of Us 2, and the thing is, last, I mean, listen, for me, I'm not, you're not going to sell me straight up from straight up gameplay. You're not. you got to have, if you're going to have, you know, a, a great, some great gameplay, that story better make up for it too. That story better be great. Or if the, the or it, it goes either way. If the gameplay isn't that good, that story better make up for it. If the story, if the gameplay is bad and the story bad too, bro, no. But a lot of people care, so, a lot of people care about gameplay nowadays, right? Since people care about gameplay, people want to see that action type B. So that's pretty much what Last of Us is going to come down to. So which is why I'm saying Last of Us 2 is going to be in the game of your conversation for its gameplay alone. Top 3. Regardless of how much hate this game you get, it's still going to be in the game of your conversation. Cyberpunk is going to be game of your conversation. Uh, and, and listen, I don't even... Bro, they are really... In terms of detail and customization, Cyberpunk is already like way ahead, way ahead of everything. Um, Ghost of Tsushima... Uh, that game's gonna be a game of your conversation. Just by looking at this game, just looking at this gameplay right here, I don't know what the story is gonna be about, but from gameplay alone, this could be in a game of your conversation. Even if the story, and if the story is okay, I still see it making game of your conversation. Uh, same with Resident Evil, um, Final Fantasy, bro. Like, we can't listen. But if these three games, Last of Us 2, Cyberpunk, and Ghost of aren't in your top three, and regardless of us too, if, I'm sorry, man. You got it. You just have to. But this is the game of your competition right here. Images. It's not just the way it looks. It helps accent your chosen play style. I like that. As you explore, the I like world, how I like that different uh, uh, armor charms. gives you different They'll stats. Give you stats in your um, attack, in something like that. I like I like but games like that. More importantly, as your legend grows, you'll develop all new techniques which transform Jin from a samurai into the ghost. Okay, so if you collect is, these, you right, you get like this, the, how uh, this those armor. techniques. Okay. I like that. See, I like how I mean, it's always it gives you that extra boost in combat. You know what I'm saying? So I'm guessing this game's gonna be pretty hard as well. And you can change the color. I don't think this game's. I don't think Ghost is so gonna give you like a difficulty. How the ghost so this game is something I like. It's not gonna be anything hard like some Sekiro type beat, but it's definitely going to be like pretty challenging. If this game wasn't challenging, they'll probably just get. They they wouldn't have. Um, if this game wasn't like challenging, they'll probably just give you the armor just to show off. But they're not gonna give you like a difficulty setting. They're going to give you like a. Uh, game if it didn't have photo they're going. The game is going to decide. And our new photo game mode, we have features how, such as color grading, depth of field, so you can focus on the right objects. Armor, so I like that. We I have like a bunch it. of new features it's be, it's that really challenge. underline the motion and, this game and the movement that's so great about our game. You can control the wind's direction. Speed. Damn. You can change out the particles to different types of leaves and fireflies. You can change that? You can even select a track of music from our original score that might be a little bit more fitting. Okay. So if you're into doing a photo or maybe you actually want to do a video, there's something here for you. Here's a few that I've created. Gosh, dude, this is beautiful. And I, I, I I'm. Completely into like I love Japanese culture, but I study this stuff. Man. I love um, you know Japanese tradition and stuff like that. I love learning about these things. Man. Like these things. A Japanese voice Samurai, track option I'm, with subtitles I'm, I'm is a perfect fit for I'm our game. game. So I'm happy to say that before the first scene even starts, you'll be able to turn this option on. All right, all right, no, they're gonna. Bro, the weeds are gonna put this on in Japanese. I already know. I'm not, bro. I need my job in English. I'm sorry. I need my stuff in English. I love Japanese. I love this. I'm, I'm trying. Hey, listen, man. This is coming from a guy who's actually trying to learn how to speak Japanese. I'm trying to go to Japan one day. But I can't hear. I, I, I need my stuff in English, man. And ain't no subtitles either, bro. <laughs> That's just not helping me. That's not helping. Here at Sucker Punch, we are huge fans of Samurai Cinema. We wanted to create a way for you to feel like you're playing your favorite samurai movie. Right, so we I created a windy, too. black and white, film grained out mode that you can turn I on hope. from the very beginning of the game. All right, I probably won't have this in the game. The black and white does look nice though. Bro, that black and white does look nice though. That black and white does look nice though. 
That black and white does look nice, though. I might put it, I might actually end up playing this in black and white. It might be hard to see, though. Well, I still might get this done in black. I might play it in black and white. This is like that old Western Japanese movie type, you know, 1960s, 1950s, black and white stuff, you feel me? Bro, the, yeah, they got the, the, uh, the lines, the black lines and everything, too. Like that 1950s, 1975, no. 1975, it was color, but like 1950s or something like that. Today, we've shared with you some white. unique ways that, that you can Western explore the technique. island of Tsushima. Damn, We've also shared with you some of the ways that you can fight as bro, a samurai. Visuals too. Or assassinate as the ghost. Yeah, this game might actually, they, bro. I see Ghost of winning a couple of awards. Best visuals. Special ways. Best game, maybe best gameplay. But we have so much more to show you in the future. Best graphics, like sound, ghost soundtrack, too, comes out soundtrack. They might 17. be uh, nominated for Thank soundtrack. Thank you so much for watching today. Great. We'll see you later. That's it. That's that. I think these games put on June 26th. Or June 29th. Yeah, June 29th. State of play. That was nice. Alright. That was nice. That was beautiful. Hey, man. That game was looking great. I love it. I love everything about it. Um, graphics look great. Visuals look amazing. The, uh, the detail on the grass, the flowers, the trees, the sky, the lightning, uh, the rain, the sun. Everything looks great. Uh, Jin, the character himself, looks freaking awesome. He looks freaking, he looks like a, a, a crazy swordsman. Um, the combat look, looks pretty freaking fun. It definitely doesn't look like it's repetitive or anything like that. It looks like, it, you know, it holds its own and stuff like that. It looks really freaking, it looks great. It looks a lot of fun and stuff like that. You feel me? Um... But yeah, I honestly I don't know. I mean, I I don't know. I, I listen. My only listen. My only thing is, how many hours are giving out is? I have a couple questions. How big is the world? How many hours are we getting out of this? And uh, wait, I think that maybe there was two. I think it's two. So how, how big is the world? How many questions are beginning out of this? How many uh, hours are beginning out of this? Those are my two questions. My two questions that I got for this game. So. Yeah, I'm out. I'm out. That's much I got to say about this. Other than that, this game looks freaking amazing. But I'm not playing. If this game messes around to be 25 to 35 hours, I'm going to be very upset. I'm going to be very upset. I want this, this game better be like, I'll give you even 50 hours, 60 or 75. If it ain't one of them three, them three hours, I'm going to be really mad. Just saying that right now. Do not disappoint me on some infamous second sun type time. So, yeah, that's all I got to say about this, guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay, stay, stay fresh. with Maj Marcus or Maj Marcus TV, whatever you guys want to call me. I'll see you guys in my next video, man. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And, uh, yeah. Bye, Z. All right.